Hello, 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 and welcome to Workouts for Older Men Live. I'm Skip, of course, so glad you are joining me for our show, our chance to connect. I want to entertain you. Not too good at the entertaining part, right? Uh, maybe motivate you, inspire you, uh, give you the information that you need to take your body, your entire life to a higher level now that you're a little bit older. I'm the great simplifier. I want to simplify the process. Uh, in a fitness world on the internet where it seems like everything is so complicated, it's conflicting, uh, the fitness experts uh, argue amongst themselves and uh, you're in the crosshairs and uh, sometimes just tell me what to do. I know you want to know exactly what to do. Uh, you want me to sell you, convince you that what you're doing is the right thing so you can move forward with certainty and confidence when it's going well and when you're wondering, am I getting enough gains? Am I losing fat the way that I should? Right. And uh, you got to have some reasonable time frame. Someone's got to explain that to you. I know that's what you want. That's what I'm here for. If you ever want one on one coaching. All right. A lot of guys just let's just talk about it. You can reach out to me. My information is all throughout uh, my website, skipplecore.com. Go there often for a library of videos and podcasts and blog posts. Uh, look uh, down below in the description of uh, this video and uh, this broadcast and uh there'll be many ways for you to get a hold of me we can talk about a coaching package for you uh, so say hello 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 tell me where you're watching me from if you're watching the replay version make sure that you say hello 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 too in this video i want to continue my series of videos of the top 10 things that older men should know about fitness but really no one's going to really bother to tell you all right the top 10 things that older men should know about fitness, but no one's really going to bother to tell you. And, and really, it's just goes against the grain. It's counterintuitive. Uh, there's too many people uh, that are commenting, uh, making videos, uh, uh, saying it's a different way. And, you know, if you do it that way, it isn't like it's, it's going to totally destroy your effort. It's going to lead to confusion. It's not going to really make sense if you ever make the other side and you'll realize that nuance, what makes the real difference, the mindset and the strategies for those who get to that top 20%, uh, that top 5%. But right now, it's just too hard to explain. It's, I can, I, and today's, it, it's something I talk about all the time. But I'm just amazed when someone does talk to me on the phone, maybe they get my $147 package, the biggest fitness challenge that older men make and their solutions, a comprehensive package I have with a 90 minute video, exercise routine, uh, 11 hours of 12 modules of breaking it all down, uh, all in a real focused manner. You can go to solutionswithskep.com uh, to check that out. But you get an hour long conversation with me. Oh, Skip, I watch all your videos. All right. And, uh, and you give such great information, and that's why I'm investing in this program. I'm so glad I could talk to you. And to me, it's just interesting, really smart, successful men, how they miss the key things that, in my mind, I am emphasizing. I'm telling you over and over again, the organizing principles to make this happen. But I just know it's counterintuitive, and even really smart men are, are missing them. It, it's, you know, I would have to get you one-on-one. -on -one. I would have to work with you weeks to wrinkle out those. Not that you're not hearing me, but to understand uh, the right amount of uh, emphasis you need to put on the things. You may be doing it, but unless you put more heat, more emphasis on it, you're not going to get the results that you want. And you may think that I do it. Today, I want to talk about nutrition, something I always talk about, or at least in my mind, I talk about it all the time, all right? And uh, it's what you need to know is when people say, uh, being fit, looking good, building muscle, losing body fat, right? Being healthy, that it's 80% nutrition, 20% training. Let me just tell you, you're being lied to. You know why? It's more than that. It's more than that. It's that crucial. But you would have to do everything right, get that training down, quit bopping around thinking that your physique is going to change. Just concentrate on overload. Be consistent. And then get that dial uh, dialed in. You'll know what I'm talking about, right? But it gets so much resistance now. I mean, when you do this, a lot of times when we, okay, I want a better body. Hey, I got to work out, right? So we don't even think about that first step and how much of a priority we should put, effort we should put into training. We just assume that and we're looking all for all the strategies and uh, 
our body improves. And once it improves, we just think we need more of it. And then it stalls. And then we say, well, how do I get to the next level? It must be the right training routine. My body needs this. I got to find one specifically for me. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That nutrition is important. I kind of do it or whatever. I know I need to, to do it more. But you must not know it if you really want that physique. If you're frustrated and you're training hard in the gym, when you know the answer is with nutrition, you just got to dig into it a little bit deeper. You don't have to make it super complex. Then you really don't understand the importance of nutrition. Now, it, it isn't helpful that, you know, 90% of everything you see, even me, you know, what, what grabs your attention? When I'm sitting in my little studio talking to you about nutrition, something you really would rather not pay attention to anyway, or seeing me in the gym, the clanking of the gym, seeing uh, muscles popping, right? Where 90% or more is muscles and working out. And that's what you thought going in this journey. That's what you hope. You, you could kick it right an hour or so in the gym, six or seven days a week, right? Training, training, training. You want it to be training. You're convinced it's training. You look around. It seems like it's training. You put all your emphasis there. And you don't do it to nutrition, <laughs> right? So, you know, at this age, I'm not saying, oh, do I get big muscles? I got to eat those nutrients and work overload. And then I'm repairing and I'm growing and grow all this you know, pounds, 10 pounds of sheer muscle now that I'm in my 50s. No, it's not really that way either. Sure, when you eat, uh, you, you give your body the nutrients that it needs, enough of it, and you break down the muscle through overload training. I mean, uh, I don't know how much muscle you're going to be or sheer pounds, uh, but you're definitely going to maintain what you have and give yourself the best chance. You're not going to get older and lose more and more muscle mass. That That's for sure. But how lean you are, right, is going to make the big biggest difference. You know, I'm looking at myself and doing this 75 hard challenge. And although I had to start over again, I uh, didn't read uh, my chapter one day, so I started all over again. Um, but I have I just stuck to my diet. I had a pretty clean diet before, but I really stuck to it since the 11th. So we're not even here a month. So, and I'm like, oh, man. I'm impressing me in the gym. I'm looking at uh, the videos that I'm shooting for this dial. I'm going, man, that's happening quick. Just a little bit more attention to an already good diet. The, the skin is getting thinner, but it's not just don't eat food. It's not just avoid food. You got to make sure you know how much you're eating and make sure it's enough too. You can't just, all I hear on the internet, calorie deficit. It's, it's more than that. It's not nuclear science, but you got to know it. It makes all the difference in the world. If you're stuck at, 20, 22% body fat, and you're saying, I'm a big guy, I got muscle. Yeah, you know, I just gotta get a little bit leaner. And you keep on saying that. You don't know how important nutrition is. I'm telling you, um, it's so forgiving. You don't have to have the perfect training strategy. You just have to be consistent because whatever you do have, it's gonna just be shown to you. And you're gonna say, wow, my shoulders are a lot bigger now that I'm lean. They're nice and round. I do have a good body. Maybe the shape of my biceps, they were just, uh, layered with uh with with body fat now they lost that body fat i like the shape i've got good shape right nutrition 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 oh man i can't emphasize stuff it makes all the difference in the world and i know you're not getting that information it's boring it's boring you know what are you going to do meal prep make a whole what are the guys going to make a video meal prep saturday have their foods i mean it's boring after a while it doesn't get views most men don't even want to pay attention to nutrition they want to hope that the training is going to give you that body that they want right and so influencer board does make good videos you don't want to hear it view the videos aren't going to get any views people want to know the right training routine so they pound the visuals of training and we just lose track but that nutrition you know and I know you hear it, but you, and you know you know it, but it's got to be emphasized 20 times more for you to actually get it. That's what you need to know about fitness, and it's just so hard to communicate that one-sided. So I love the one-on-one -on -one coaching. If, you're, if you really want to break through, reach out to me. I know I have a package, some package for you, and I can explain this to you, right? So, Kennedy, I just, you know, I kind of... Uh, get a little uh, hopeless i've said it again but for some reason it just doesn't register we, even with the the smartest guys that were most ambitious but i'll just go from there all right
hello, Kirk. Uh, it's going very well. I, you know, I just talked about the 75 hard going very well. Nutrition, Jose says nutrition. The truth hurts. Well, if you, it doesn't hurt if you don't accept it or don't accept it fully, Jose, like many very smart men. Hello, 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 Darren on Facebook. Uh, raw nutrition, never heard of her. <laughs> yeah, right. We have a blind spot. Leg day was brutal. Awesome, Jose. Hello, 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 Mark. Great to have you here, sir. Hello, hello, hello. Uh, thoughts on single arm cross upper body upright rows. Single arm cross, whatever. Is, is that's a TikTok? Uh, that's a TikTok uh, chest shaping exercise. If I'm not, if not, uh, I I'm, I think that's what you're describing. Would have never seen that without social media. A rip guy getting a cable and going like this. And he says, see that upper chip? See those striations? That's because they have this very light cable and I'm just shaping the muscle so perfectly, right? Um, you know what I think about that? Good for TikTok. It's not going to do anything. Overload. It's not that complex. Bruce, hello, hello, hello. Great to have you here. And Kirk, where am I from? I live in California. Oh, Santos. Hello, 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 Santos. All right guys all right john hello 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 great to have you here sir all right guys so uh that is going to do it uh as i continue to count down 10 things about fitness that uh older men should know about but no one's going to really take the time uh to uh explain it to you it just seems to go nowhere, right? But I want to do my best to help you with that breakthrough. All right, so let's take on the day with a sense of urgency. We have to when we're a little bit older. We've got more time behind us than we do in front of us. Have a great day.